I've done heavy lifting as a conservative fighter here in our state legislature, and I know that's a transferable skill and ability back in D.C. A big name in Utah politics is considering a run for U.S. Senate. In an interview with me, House Speaker Brad Wilson outlined why he's considering a run for the Senate seat currently held by Senator Mitt Romney. I understand this state in a way that's very unique. House Speaker Brad Wilson has opened an exploratory committee. It allows him to fundraise as he considers a Senate run. I'm going to make a decision over the course of uh, the next few months as I go around the state and listen to what people are looking for. Uh, what I believe is in the best interest of the state of Utah and, and what's interest in, in the best interest of my family. But the speaker tells me he believes his work in the Utah State Legislature would translate to Washington, D.C. In fact, Washington uh, needs to be a lot more like Utah. And we've got an opportunity to send Utah values back to D.C. And we need to make sure that we have a conservative fighter back there uh, to make Washington a lot more like Utah. Senator Romney has opened his own exploratory committee, but hasn't committed to running for re-election. He's faced criticism from some quarters of the Republican Party for his votes on President Trump's impeachments and crossing the aisle to back other legislation. Speaker Wilson declined to critique Senator Romney's record in the Senate. He also isn't weighing in on who he would support on the Republican ticket for president, except to say he'll do what he's done previously, vote for the Republican nominee. There will be a time once we know who is running for president and we have all the declared candidates to, to weigh in on that. I think it's premature to make that decision. My focus right now is what's in the best interest of the state of Utah in terms of the U.S. Senate. Speaker Wilson could be a formidable name in the Senate race. He's enjoyed outsized influence on state policy from Utah's Capitol Hill and won bipartisan praise for his work on saving the Great Salt Lake. One of the skills that uh, I think uh, I bring to the table is the ability to get a lot of people with very differing opinions together and get them to work together on hard things and solve hard challenges. And if there's a place in the world that needs that skill set, it is Washington, D.C. While his exploratory committee is still open, Speaker Wilson will still be in charge here on Utah's Capitol Hill. He says he'll make a formal decision later this year. On the Hill, Ben Winslow, Fox 13 News, Utah.